Center Fox. Coverage you can count on. Comic books in the classroom, an unconventional way to teach reading, is being tested in local schools. And the comics are getting support now from a real-life football hero. Bianca De La Garza explains in tonight's Education Matters. When he's not playing football, former Patriot Christian Fourier is reading comic books. Were you a big reader growing up yourself? No, I was not. If I'm going to be honest, no. Now he reads all the time with his four children. A favorite, Scooter McDougal comic books. Friend and former Boston College football star Omari Walker told Fourier about the educational comics. The principal of Fall River Alternative High School knows how popular they are. I think that the biggest sign of success is the fact that the kids are stealing them. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and that, you know, those are the only textbooks that have ever been stolen out of our building. Walker's students struggle with literacy, reading at middle or elementary school levels. The colorful books featuring characters from Greek mythology appeal to them. Good There's person. an earth boy named Neil Scooter McDougal. It's a comic book, but it was made as an educational book. So it's not like a Spider-Man comic book that you would pick up. Creators know some schools are skeptical about using comics, but after 37 years of teaching, Leo Stebbins never seen anything making kids love reading like this. It was something that they hated to do, was not instilled in, into them. So they were turned off to reading, and this somehow turned them back on. Fourier so convinced he's now investing in the company and giving books to his kids' Cumberland, Rhode Island school district. Every teacher has that fine line of, you know, how much fun can I make um, the learning process and how much content do I have to introduce. And, and I think in this case, it accomplishes both. Now, the company admits it plans on expanding past books. There's talk of a movie and merchandise, something school districts will no doubt weigh when considering whether or not to add them to the curriculum. But if administrators do want to try them right now, the company will give them a set for free. For more information, go to thebostonchannel.com. I'm Bianca De La Garza, News Center 5. Hmm. Anything it takes to get them interested Don't you in agree? reading. Don't yeah, you agree it's with like that? a springboard for sure. other books. Sure, too. sure. Open the door and they'll walk right. in. Yeah.